Y'all, Joe Biden came out to talk about the whole thing with um no with Diddy and his ex fiance. Well, I don't think she even said yes. Um, but the Tahiri she basically called him out. Um, and was very shocked that he was condemning Diddy for his actions or whatever. As we all know, Joe Budden has had um, a history, allegedly, of beating women from okay. Sin Santana to Tahiri and numerous others. Um, wow. There have been a lot of allegations out about him and everything. Mm. Everything is alleged. Um, but she called him out and was like, F out of here. Who the irony? This is so triggering. I remember Joey throwing me down a flight of steps wow. and dragging me back into the house and me having to talk to him into letting me go for wow. hours. This whole stuff took me out so hard to watch. So sorry for Cassie and every other woman who is currently going through it or has ever gone through it. It's tough. Mm, mm. So I just want to talk about these men who are coming out and are condemning Diddy. Mm-hmm. And but have a history of beating women. Mm-hmm. I just think it's best not to say anything. Yeah. Unless you're going to talk about the things you have done and talk about how you have changed and why it's so horrible to do these type of things to women, I don't think they should say anything. It's because like you can't they talk have about the Diddy. Right message, but they're just the wrong messenger in a sense because it's like. But I don't even know if it's genuine because my thing is you used to do the same thing to women. No, that's why it's the wrong messenger because you are guilty of the same thing. Yeah. Like yes, what Diddy is done is wrong. That's the right message, but you cannot be the one delivering that because you're an abuser yourself. Yeah, and I don't really think it's genuine. Yeah, I feel like he's probably saying it because one, he has a podcast; two, is a popular mm-hmm. topic, and then three. He's feeling like he has to say something. But my thing is, have you really learned from all things that you've done? Especially since you um, allegedly have done it so often. So I feel like these men who have these history, who has this history, and especially men who came out and were calling um, Cassie a gold digger. I just feel like... That's why I wonder. I wonder what did he say before the video came out that actually saw what happened? You know, before when she just accused him, Mm -hmm. right? I wonder what... Because there are people who... Did not believe her. A lot of people said she was a gold digger and she just wanted the money. And they were like, oh, They're like, well, she stayed with him for so long a time. How come? As though they don't understand that. It takes at least eight times for a woman to leave her abuser before they actually leave. Mm -hmm. Um, And then on top of that, they were like, oh, well, she settled so quickly. She must have just wanted the money. I'm sorry. Especially all the nasty stuff he had her doing. Mm. The last thing I want to do is be on a stand. Look at this sick freak having to relive it and talk about it. That's the last thing I want to do. Yeah. So I can understand why she settled, and I can understand why did he settle so quickly? Because he probably wanted to that's, go away. Well, that's that's but what I was thinking. Like, like he, he must be guilty. Yeah. Well, he uh, he had, he proved that. Mm-hmm. Um, but I also feel like he really was trying to call her bluff, and then when he realized that she actually went through with it, that she wasn't ashamed and she wasn't going to hide in fear anymore, I think he was shocked, and that's why he. Went tried ahead. to settle it real quickly thinking it'll go away right but then that opened up a whole entire can of worms and stuff right um and then you saw this free fall even there's a new accuser coming out and accusing diddy of um sa as well mm. Mm. um so it's all quite a bit but i just think joe budden he's the last person he you know notorious for being an a-hole yeah. i feel yeah. um but yeah i just feel like if you were an abuser just don't talk <laughs> like just talk about something else, else. Yeah. i i guarantee you nobody is interested in what you have to say certainly not on this topic yeah not at all especially when you don't say anything to women um but yeah y'all that's all we had to say about this one you all let us know down below what you think about this whole mess yeah. and we will see you guys on the next video bye